Okay. What's up, guys? This is Jeremy. I'm here at Menfluential, as you can see. And this is my review about Giorgio Armani Absolute. Let's see. Oh, Crystal, can I ask you for your opinion if you like this fragrance? And could you tell us if you would like to smell this on a man or is that just an average fragrance for men? What does spontaneously come to your head? I don't think it's strong enough for a man. It's just so-so. Yeah. A teenager fragrance. Like it's, ca like it's casual. Casual. It's not manly enough for me. Cool. Very nice description. Thank you. Let's see. I don't know this woman. Sorry. Can I ask you, do you like to smell this on a man or is this just an average fragrance? This is average. Average. There's nothing extraordinary about it. It's a typical men's cologne. Yes. Fresh out of the shower. Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Thank you. Okay, guys. So, quick description of this Aqua di Joe Absolu. We have, of course, the superstar Aqua di Joe. We have Ascensa, which is a good addition. It's a stronger version of the original Aqua di Joe. We have the absolute mega star, which is Aqua di Joe Profumo, with addition of incense and patchouli, both very strong and masculine fragrance notes that make the DNA more masculine and it's great. And this one is a youthful approach to the original Aqua di Joe. So it's more fruity. It's not only aquatic like the original Aqua di Gio, it has a big load of fruits added. So it's more teenager friendly. Oh guys, up, Benjamin. Jim? Travis. Travis, sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, Man, okay. would you wear this fragrance or is it just average? For me personally, I wouldn't, but it's still, it's still not bad. It's a new Armani, but okay. my rating also will be just average. Yeah. It's, it's the fruity, it's forgettable. Yeah, I prefer sweeter. Yeah. Yeah, like parfums cool. and things like that. Yeah. Thanks, Travis. Yeah, no See you in a second. Okay, guys, so that's the explanation. How long, how does it smell? How long does it actually last? It doesn't last so long. It clearly does not last as long as the Profumo and also not as long as the Essenza. If you want to compare it with the Aqua di Gio, I don't compare it with that because Aqua di Gio is Aqua di Gio. This is a very teenager friendly, teenager fragrance. And in that teenager vibe, we have a lot of competition like Invictus Aqua. We have Abercrombie and Fitch First Instinct. We have even Dior Sauvage. Fragrances that are better in performance, more unique, better ladies reactions. So. For me, this is not a fragrance that blows me away. But let's see, I also asked other girls what they think about this fragrance. So let's see what they thought. One second. Don't look, please, oh. because you might know the fragrance. Okay, oh, there's the car coming away. Oh, because we might know the fragrance. Oh, okay. I didn't like. <laughs> so, if you would smell this on a man, would you think he smells sexy or not? Let's see. Okay. What's your first impression? Yes. Yes. Chanel blue. It's not. <laughs> it's not bleu de Chanel. I like it. <laughs> okay. It's hey, very fresh. I love it. It's the guy. Very clean. What's up, bro? Yeah, it's the clean. superstar here. Oh. <laughs> made cool videos What's about up, Donald Trump and <laughs> yeah. why he wins the election. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it. It's so, hey, so cool to see you so here. Cool see the you. guys are all in size. Are you here for the end? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's awesome. very clean. I will right, we'll catch you guys. Okay. Sharp. Yeah. It's clean and sharp. It's super sexy. Like you have a real job. <laughs> yeah, it smells like you have a real job. Okay, cool. Love it. Okay, one to ten. If ten is the best fragrance ever, how would you rate it? I would say it's high up there, like an eight. An okay, eight. eight. Good. And also what I did in my office in Germany, I asked the girl, which one do you prefer? This one or Aqua di Gio Profumo? So let's see what she said. <laughs> what do you think about this fragrance for a man? Is this attractive or not? Yes, it is. How attractive? From one to 10? Eight, I will give eight. Immediately an eight out of 10. Do you find it unique, so it smells different, or does it smell like everything else? It's different. Of. Good. Okay, cool. So, 
Um, I would like to know, please, yes? please take this in the left hand. Okay. Come here. And this one, we have to see which one you prefer between these two. So this in the right hand. And let's see which of these two is better, left or right. I think this one yeah? is better. Nice. And Why? I like it. Why? I like it more. More masculine? Yes, I think so. More depth. Nice, cool. Hello. So, as you can see, this is the fragrance that is a nice release. It's good, it's inoffensive, but in that inoffensive, fresh compliment getter, fresh out of the shower realm, there are better ones. Like Dior Sauvage, Bleu de Chanel, you know the story. So this, for me, is just an okay release. That's Aqua Di Joe, Absolute. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.